One of the first things that Rachel and I ever talked about when we were uh, going for a job interview, really, for the, um, for, uh, together for the Adelaide Festival, was an idea of Miriam Margulies being the narrator on uh, Prokofiev's Peter in the Wolf. And um, so it was, it's particularly delightful that we've been able to grab Miriam and put her with um, Nicholas Carter directing the Adelaide Symphony Orchestra in this beautiful kids program. Uh, I grew up with someone called Wilfred Pickles narrating Peter and the Wolf and, <laughs> um, in, the, in the grand English tradition. And um, uh, this is just going to be a very, a very special concert um, for the whole family. Uh, it's being um, presented with our great friends at the Adelaide Symphony Orchestra who have the really exciting Nicholas Carter as their new chief conductor. Um, it's, uh, so teaming uh, Nick with, uh, with Miriam, whose sense of fun, whose very strong sense of mischief and, uh, and, a, and a wicked sense of humour is, I think, going to uh, really create the right context to introduce children to classical music. The program isn't just Peter and the Wolf, it's also Jana Czech's Cunning Little Vixen. Borodin's... The Palozzi and Dances from uh, Prince Igor. That's right. And Britain's oh, yes. Young Person's Guide to the Orchestra, which, which, is all, which also has, a, uh, has Miriam narrating. Britain's amazing work uses a, a theme of uh, Henry uh, Purcell as the, as the basic fugue and um, the, it, it takes the audience right through every group of the orchestra uh, and it's an amazing, it's what it is, it's a young person's guide to the orchestra. It's like an introduction to, uh, to the experience of listening to uh, an orchestra play. The great thing about it though, I mean, that, that, you know, I, I, I would hate anyone watching this to think, oh, it sounds like medicine. It's, uh, the great thing about it is that it's so much fun. We all know that kids have pretty limited uh, attention spans and Anyone who thinks, oh, my children will not cope with classical music, this is the uh, perfect example of how classical music has, some classical music has been written very specifically to engage and excite kids.